The fourth planet orbiting the Sun, Mars, has been known since ancient times in Egypt and Greece. The vision of people back then was remarkable. However, it was not until the 17th century in the time of Galileo Galilei that we were able to get a better look at Earth's small neighbor through a telescope. Mars has always attracted dreamers who wish to conquer space. Moreover, at present, Mars is the only planet we can realistically visit in the near future. Considering just gravity, Mars is worth visiting as its gravity is only about a third of Earth's. For someone who weighs 100 kg on Earth, they would only weigh about 33 kg on Mars, an intriguing motivation, isn't it? Now let's dive into the exploration of Mars. Humanity has long gazed at the cosmos, dreaming of discovering other worlds. However, wishing alone is not enough to make it a reality. To land humans on Mars, extensive training and detailed planning are necessary. The preparation for future colonization began with Mars exploration a few years ago. The progress in spaceflight schools and rocket manufacturing has allowed us to send numerous devices to study Mars's composition and terrain. The first mission to Mars was planned by the Soviet Union in 1971, but it ended in failure. Despite this, humanity did not give up on exploring Mars. NASA's Viking missions followed, launched in 1976 and achieved success. Since the late 1970s, scientists have been able to obtain images of the Martian surface and data on its soil chemistry. Currently, Mars is being observed from its orbit by the European Space Agency, and NASA's Curiosity rover has even acquired citizenship on Mars, offering fascinating tours of local attractions. Most Mars exploration activities share one common goal, to understand as much as possible about the planet's past to plan for its future. In the past few years, several exciting discoveries on Mars have delighted the scientific community. The existence of liquid water essential for life has been a significant breakthrough in Mars research. Curiosity has made astonishing discoveries, suggesting that millions of years ago, Mars had rivers and possibly even oceans. Scientists have compared geological processes on Earth and Mars and concluded that rivers once flowed on Mars, indicating conditions suitable for the emergence of life. The Perseverance rover, on the other hand, found special crystals in Martian rocks near the Jezero crater, suggesting multiple contacts with water billions of years ago when Jezero crater was a lake. The presence of water is crucial because water is a key component of life. The discovery of organic molecules by curiosity is another monumental find. However, these discoveries do not yet conclusively prove that life existed or currently exists on Mars. The Mars Express orbiter detected methane bursts in the Martian atmosphere, which could suggest biological activity, but the origin of this methane is still debated among scientists. Future Mars settlers will face numerous challenges such as finding water, growing food, protecting themselves from the cold and radiation, and dealing with sandstorms. However, the most critical need will be oxygen. The Mars Science Laboratory mission has detected oxygen in the Martian atmosphere and the Perseverance rover has succeeded in extracting oxygen, although the process is currently complex and energy intensive. The first flight on Mars achieved by the Ingenuity helicopter in 2021 marked a significant milestone, proving that controlled flight is possible even in Mars's thin atmosphere. This achievement opens up new possibilities for exploring Martian terrain. All ongoing research and exploration on Mars will be invaluable for future settlers, helping to establish a new civilization on the Red Planet. There's still time to prepare as it's promised that the first humans will be sent to Mars within the next 10 years. Now is the time to start intense training.